Hey, welcome back and in, in today's video. I was gonna do the sub Sunday talk with you. I was gonna do a video that I picked from you, but I just I got something that's weighing on my mind a little bit. I just kinda wanna talk about it a little bit. Um but I will do tomorrow's video I'll pick from uh, the suggestions in the community tab to to do so sub Sunday's video is gonna be tomorrow basically. But right now like um I know a lot of my viewers um uh a lot of you guys uh have a lot you're going through some tough things um things a lot of things are hitting you all at once uh i know some of you guys have some uh severe issues i know that some of you guys are even disabled um i was talking to uh someone that had spina bifida and they were basically in the in a wheelchair their entire lives you guys don't know what that what spina bifida is it's just basically where um a, a part of your spine is exposed it wasn't very developed at birth and it causes some uh, neurological issues and some things like that and i think about these things and i really try to pay attention to how it makes me feel and i want to just be like uh telling tell to tell people it's it's okay and that everything's going to be fine but then there are these people that are that have these traumas that have these uh different uh things going on with them that they have to deal with every day uh you know to imagine to wake up and have to deal with something like that for most of us would be extremely just like we probably wouldn't be able to even visualize it because the mind does crazy things to things that it is it finds like unknown uh, we haven't experienced that we don't have the reference points to go about even how to speak on that I, I certainly uh, couldn't even begin to talk to you about that I just know how it makes me feel and as a leader in this community um, I just feel like it's, it's my place to to talk to you guys about it and I you you see me in your live streams and in your videos in the comment section just there to support because I just feel like that's the best that I can do but I want to do more you know I want to use this platform to show you guys that you can make a difference and you can do something else but to be completely honest with you like um I talk to you you guys that are disabled and you've been in wheelchairs your entire lives and you just don't seem to be sad about it at all you guys are mostly very optimistic you guys are some of the happiest people that um i think i've ever talked to and it's really refreshing uh to see that um i guess it's because you guys have you know grown up with it like that uh, some of you guys wasn't even supposed to live past the age of 18 but you're well in in past your uh, late 30s and that in itself is a a miracle and I know uh, I was talking to Dominic formerly known as hidden face uh, you were talking about just giving it your 1% every day you know waking it waking up and the things that you achieve every day don't have to be like these huge monumental things you were just talking about how um, you were go taking your wheelchair and you were crossing some railroad tracks and it was that how how scary that was for you and how how much of a how big of a deal it was that you did that that day and how it was just a level of achievement that you, you was you was struggling with versus how other people um complain about not having you know they ran out of ketchup and you know they're just so depressed that day or things like it really puts it in perspective is what i'm trying to say and uh, i think that you guys are the true heroes uh, to be able to wake up and do those things and I would have to say that for anyone that's going through any kind of difficult thing or challenge um, you just wake up and get that one percent the Japanese called it Kana it was it was spelled K-A-N-U I think Kanu Kana and uh, then the Americans uh, adopted it to make it be Kana which is which stands for uh, constant and never-ending improvement and I think that that's what you do daily. Um, as long as you're getting that, just that 1% in, um, it, it get, do that 1% every day. It doesn't have to be a huge thing. It can be the smallest, tiniest thing as 
crossing the road tracks in your wheelchair. But if you do these things for yourself every single day, it's that 1%. And you do that every single day of the year, 365 days, by the end of the year, you will be a different person. I guess what I'm trying to say is that um, we all have our struggles that we're going through. And we don't have to be ashamed about those struggles. It's okay to cry. It's okay to feel uh, challenged. It's okay to go through these feelings. Um, you don't truly fail unless you stop. So as long as you're still moving, you're still going, you have not failed yet. And failure is the greatest teacher. And success is born of failure. Don't forget that. But with that being said, and as interesting as it was, I'm always interested in what you think. So why don't you go ahead and leave your creative and or interesting responses in the comment box below. Thumbs up for those likes. And as always, brothers and sisters, I will see you in the next video. Because I know that you're repping. And if you're not repping, you're Gregging. And how do you become a member of the Rep Squad? Well, all you got to do is subscribe with notifications turned on. Be in the comment section after every single video because I'm going to be there. Greg the Cat's going to be there. And the rest of the Rep Squad community is going to be there. And I expect to see you there too because this channel loves you.